Hello and welcome back to Prison Architect. My name is Nicky Root. Let's get cracking. Today we're going to continue to work on the health and well-being grant because uh, we've got uh, we've got to build a medical ward. Now here's my thoughts. Okay, I was doing a bit of reading and I discovered that uh, if you can stick a staff room uh, on the other side of an infirmary, it will force your staff to walk through the infirmary to the staff room and get healed on the way through. So I like that idea. Now that means that we're going to need to rejig a few things. This will stay as the staff room, but we'll put the door over here. Now we'll move the kitchen over here. Uh, I think that that's, uh, that's a good good plan. So that means we're going to dismantle all the cookers and the, and the fridges. Especially the fridges. The sinks. Done. And then we're going to put them in over here. So... The sinks. We'll put uh, one there. And one there. Right. Uh, the serving table can stay where it is. We'll throw two fridges in there. And then two cookers in. Looks alright to me. Then obviously we've got the st staff door here. Once all this goes in, we'll move some things around. Now, what I actually want to do as well, I'm thinking... No, uh, I'll... See, I'm, I'm thinking, do I want to put a storeroom near this so that the food is accessible? But I don't think it works like that. So let's just assign this as a kitchen. Here we go, kitchen. And we'll remove that as a kitchen. So now this this is where all the cooking will happen. Obviously the serving table will stay there. And God damn our our prison is so damn grubby. We can't get a janitor yet either. Let me have a look at research. Let's see. Let's let's just get it because <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> uh, uh, da, 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 da. Let's grab him as well. Because he's cheap. And psychology, why not? And health. Let's do it all. Let's do it all. So we're going to need a psychiatrist. Psychologist. A medical ward and at least two doctors. So this, this here, I'm thinking this here will become our medical ward. Now, I'd like to... This in. Throw a staff door here. And this I will dismantle. Okay, so staff door there. The wall's going to go in there. And where's the infirmary? I require health. Am I unlocking health? Yes, I am. Wonderful. So that'll be unlocked shortly. Also, what I can do is unlock a staff door here so that people can walk through. This one, however, I will dismantle. Uh, yeah. You can see our storeroom is uh, getting quite full. That's alright though. Doors and walls and all sorts. Now we've got the common room over here, so that seems to be working okay. Uh, we need to plumb all this in before before daybreak. So let's get some small pipes. Job done. Some electrical power cables. Oh, what the hey. Let's just do that. That works for me. Uh, our research is going along smoothly. And then security will be next. These two obviously haven't started yet because uh, it requires the warden. 
So we'll hold that one and get health first. Okay. Uh, seems to be going okay, I think. Workshop. While making car license plates. Hmm. How we're looking. It's growing. The prison is slowly growing. Apparently I still haven't had any problems with uh, with my uh, shower block or lack thereof. Uh, what do we want to do? I think we're like all okay for the moment. How are we looking? Steadily. We're going steadily. Uh, what else we got? Kitchen? Kitchen is up and running. That's ex excellent news. Now, what I want to do though is I want to block this in. Because I don't want that sitting open. That would be bad. We'll demolish that. I'll probably actually dismantle this as well. And then just block that in with the door. Actually block it in with the wall. It'd be a more accurate description of what we are going to try and do here. Get a brick wall so it matches in. Even though my jail is quite haphazard. Has a bit of everything really with the walls. Let's see, look, there's one there. Just turns into concrete. Done. How are we going? Oh dear. Uh, yep. We'll put a hold on him because I want health first. Now I discovered that we have logistics. Which, if we can, we can set uh, prisoners to actually work in here. Max job four. So we'll send four in there. But to do that, what we need is uh, them to be qualified. So we'll do that. Uh, we'll turn on this program, or I did before, and that will allow them to uh, to come in here and learn about the kitchen, and then hopefully uh, they'll do some jobs in there. And and generally be uh, helpful members. Okay, we're okay. It's all okay. So it's time for a shower. So they'll go up there and let them all in. There's five visitors on site in two groups. Well, that'll help matters. How's this looking? So we've got cleaning. Which means that we can get a janitor. 50 bucks per day. I'll get two of them. Because we need a lot of cleaning. <laughs> Hopefully two is enough to keep the place clean. No, that's okay. Wonderful. So we've still got four more prisoners than we actually have capacity for. Hmm. Power's okay. What does this look like? Requires the warden. Requires the warden. We want health. Indoors and a medical bed. What does the medical bed look like? Where is the medical bed? 
It's tree morgue slab. Ah, we can't unlock it yet. Of course. So I think with uh, our ward, we'll get two doctors and two beds. We'll just speed things up a little bit. Do I want to change that door with just a normal door? Nah, we'll leave it as a large one. Screw them. We'll make it unlock it. What I'll do... I'm just going to search everything. Just for the, the lols. And while we're waiting for this research to finish. Found. What did we find? A shank. Where's that? Oh, cell phone. It was worth it. It was worth it. We're not even halfway. We're only a third. Oh, there's some scissors. Sneaky little buggers. Oh, what was that? Poison. Booze. <laughs> Someone's getting drunk. <laughs> Oh man, I'm glad I did the shakedown now. Maybe I should do that every couple of days. Oh, more booze. Contraband. Contraband everywhere. What does this look like? Are we done yet? Yes, we're done. Excellent. So we can assign this as a medical ward now. There we go. That's the infirmary. Uh, and for the infirmary, we need the medical bed and two doctors. Right, so where's the objects? And the medical bed. Here we go. There's the janitor. Maybe we need another janitor or six. Because <laughs> we're pretty dirty. Uh, yeah, it seems like we've caught a lot of things. Which is good. Ninja. Hire a psychologist. Can we... Requires psychology. Okay, well let's go in here. Well, let's keep going with that then. And we can get a... We can get another person now. Uh, what we'll do is we need to designate a cleaning cupboard. Ooh, some more scissors. That's alright. That's not too bad. Could be worse. Could be a gun. Uh... Where you send your dead prisoners and staff to? No, that's not. That's not okay. Whatever. There's a cleaning cupboard. What's that? Ciggies. Cigarettes. Oh my lord. There'll be stuff all through this. Eight awaiting solitary confinement. <laughs> We're turning up all sorts now. We've nearly got a all search there. That's great. I've got confidence in my... Um, in my prison being much, much uh, cleaner. Uh, why are these... Hello. Let's go see if we can...
Righty -o. So we need a psychologist. That's the next thing. Uh, we need to research that though. Uh, so we can get the chief of security as well. Hmm. Hmm. Do we make this a giant storeroom? I think we do. Once all that's gone, we'll just do that. Make that the storeroom. To change this into an office. I like it. It's a good plan. Glad we thought of that. Uh, there's bleach and shit in here. Well, at least the prison's looking a lot tidier now. Uh, the one solitary confinement uh, working away. I think we're going to need more of them, though. So what I'd like to know is how do we start kicking some people out? And I wish there was an easier way of knowing that that was finished. Okay, so that's done. We'll get our foundations. And build that. We'll get a... Ooh. Workshop stuff. Nice. Uh, where's a staff door? Get all that set up. And... Because that doesn't have a door on it. Do that then. Okay, let's get some utilities going. Well, I think that's the most convenient way of doing it actually. And we need a wall. And this is going to become a storage room. Storage, storage, storage. Shower, yard, laundry. There it is. I'm not going blind. I was wondering if I was going blind there. For a moment, but luckily, I'm not. Okay, so rooms this now is going to become an office. One big office. I'm going to throw in a desk, a chair. This can be dismantled. And we'll place a wall there. And that will work very, very well. I'm thinking that everything's working, or looking a lot better now. Staff. Here we go. Probably get rid of one of the janitors. You. You'll do nice. cook it anymore. Okay, good. Good thing to know that. Now I must remember to occasionally do some... Uh, oh, that's right, I was going to get the chief, wasn't I? So let's get the chief.
And there's the psychologist's office. So we got the grant done. Uh, say they are well treated. Are shackled in their cells or in solitary. Danger level is medium. Eight prisoners have serious complaints. Okay. Let's let's have a look. Oh, we're up to a hundred grand now. Uh, finances are going down, which is maybe a problem. I'm thinking that uh, cell block B might be the old, the way to go. Uh, prison maintenance, maybe? Have ten guards, wow. See, we're closing these down slowly. Uh, well, let's... Let's extend the cell block out and get another four people in. So we'll go... How many is it? So that's another one, two. That's all we need, isn't it? That's all we need. No, we're one short. Are we one short? No, we're not. Not one short. Okay, because we'll go there, the wall. No, wait. There. Yes, we're one short. Okay, I knew that. <laughs> oh dear. And actually what we'll do is we might add in a couple of solitaries down the end here. And how, how best to do that? So we can turn that into a soul and then do so what is it it's like a one by one that be it I don't think so hmm how to do this I'm gonna work away on this expanding this cell block to uh, and is decreasing. Excellent. We're really getting on top of the prison now, so that's great. As long as we can get this um, prison capacity down, we'll be uh, sitting real pretty. Oh, we've got all the prisoners doing the cleaning as well. Which means that I am going to fire all my janitors. So it's 50 bucks a day, I can say. And the prison's going to be looking spick and span now. I'm going to keep working on this. Oh, look at that. It's low. Excellent. Alright, I look forward to seeing you in the next episode.